Hello and welcome to another video tutorial from ComputerGarGar.com and in this video we want to look at how you can freeze the top row and the first column at the same time. So if you're reading, sorry if you're, if you're watching this video uh, you're probably already familiar with the freeze panes feature, uh, the one that is on the view tab and when we go to freeze panes they give you the option of freezing the top row or freezing the first column but they don't give you the option to do both so what we are going to need for this is the first option simply known as freeze panes and it tells you in there that it's going to freeze panes based on your current selection and they show a diagram to indicate it will freeze everything above and to the left of where you are so for us to freeze the top row and the first column at the same time, we will need to click on cell B2, Bobby 2, so that it will freeze everything before where we are, which is row 1 and column A. So now when I go to the freeze panes button and choose the first option for freeze panes, it will freeze everything above and to the left of where I am. So if I did scroll down the spreadsheet, the top row is frozen. But also if I scroll to the right, although there's no need to here, the first row, sorry, the first column is also frozen. So that is how you can freeze the top row and the first column at the same time. Um, quick mention that you can apply that, that set technique to whatever you wish to freeze. See if I did unfreeze those panes for the moment. That would mean that if I wanted the first column sorry, the first row and the first three columns, I could click cell D2. So the only thing above is row one. To the left, I have three columns now. And if I choose the option to freeze panes, I now have the top row again, but now the first three columns. So you now have the potential to freeze whatever it is. If it's four rows, two columns, no three rows, no columns. Uh, you can freeze them by using that technique. Thank you for watching. Please check out some of our other tips and tricks at computergaga.com.